Hey guys, what's going on? Oh, by the way, before I uh, before I start this video up, I just want you to know that um, I'm sorry for being so inactive to all my active subscribers out there. I'm sorry for being inactive for such a long time. It's just due to the fact that it's my senior year. A lot of stuff's been going on regarding life situations, life um, plans, and all that stuff. It's been very time-consuming, as you can probably imagine, but... Anyways, let's get to the game. So today I'm playing a game called Auction Free. I'm gonna read you the description right from the store page, page and uh, <laughs> page. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, anyway, so Auction Free is a supernatural thriller about a group of friends who unwitting unwittingly open a ghostly rift. You are Alex, and you just brought your new stepbrother Jonas to an overnight island party that goes horribly wrong. So reading that, I got pretty interested into the game. Um, I've been playing a lot of FPS shooters and stuff like that, and I decided to get a new game to play. And it's story-rich, indie, adventure, so, yeah, let's get into it. Let's go. It used to be a military base. Well, it used to be a ranching thing, then it was turned into an army thing, then it became a bird thing and a museum or whatever. Henry Fonda stationed here, I think, for a bit. Unless he was Navy. Who's Henry Fonda? Around Christmas time, this little breakfast place used to sell these amazing polar bear sugar cookies. Man, those were good. And then one year they changed the formula or whatever and ruined it. Alex? Hey, still with us? You haven't said anything for like 10 minutes. Oh, gee, looks. I can watch the hypnotic rolling of the waves and listen to you at the same time. Oh, okay. What did I say? Little Miss, I can see and hear things at the same time. Um, something about Bird Island or pancakes? I don't know. Perfect. You're right on the money. <laughs> so you all moved in? Um, not, not really. I just got in this morning. And how did her mom meet your dad exactly? <laughs> they met on vacation in Orlando. He got lost in a, you know, actually, I'm not even going to tell this story. It's really not worth it. <laughs> Please don't, bro. Okay. Uh, yes, please don't. Let's not relive their meat cute any more than we have to. And you guys just met tonight? Yeah, I was, um, I'd been out of school, and the timing had just never worked out, so... And what does that make you to her, then? A, uh, second cousin? Ah, uh, roommate. I'd be like a roommate, really. No, but isn't there, like, a term <laughs> the guy's for like a um, banger. Step brother, technically. <laughs> oh, yeah. I forgot that was even a thing. Well, at least you seem cool, right? Cool guy, cool hat. You get a cool new sibling living right in your house. Sharing your toothbrush. Wearing uh, your clothes. No, that's the that's weird part. Kind of strange, I mean, bro. isn't it... The concept of just getting a new sister like a puppy, isn't it kind of awkward? <laughs> no, it's been totally bizarre. But just for the record, I don't consider you a pet. Hmm. Better not, bro. So... How do you two know each other? Oh, from way back when, like Paleozoic, grade school era. Young enough that I've seen her in a bathtub and it wasn't sexual at all. Oh. I mean, we both looked like little skinned potato blocks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, you don't see a man's toddler penis and not become best friends after that. Okay. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Bond stronger than oak. But yeah, as Check you guys can see, this is a platformer sure game, so please bear with that, but I was told the story was good, so hold on. Uh, so, how do you it's know a recording. It? They always play. Oh, oh, we should get a quick picture. All of us. This will be like the before shot. Yeah, let's do it. And it's Jonas? Not Jonah? Yeah, Jonas. Like Jonas Salk? Right, patient zero, means guy. Oppressor. Jonas. It means... Oppressor, right? Yeah, but I mean, my sign's cancer, and it's not like my hair's falling out or anything. I think you're actually cancer itself. Here's bro. good. Come on, Alex, join oh, the fun. I'm not moving. I'm an idiot. I didn't know I could move, actually. Post we, for a uh, picture. Need the girl in the picture, Alex, to balance some of this out? A what? There, great. I'll magic erase all the warts out and stuff, so don't worry. Uh, I wish I actually knew how to pose, hey, but Alex, I don't. You brought the radio, right? The little portable one? Of course. Yeah, of course. Perfect. Can you pull it out a second? How do I do? Oh, what is that? Is that like R1 or R RT? I don't even know what that is. 
There's the little guy. Oh, Our high school has a radio station, and Carly, she's Ooh. a friend of ours. She's filling in because Reggie got mono from some track runner or something. It doesn't matter. What matters is that she's going to say something like, basically, right now, about our thing. So tune it to 88.3 so I can tell her we heard it. 88.3. Which I played because that song's been stuck in my head since I woke up this morning. But, oh, oh, actually, it's a little after 10 o'clock, which means my dear friend Ren and his buddies are probably just touching down on Edwards Island for the yearly bash on the beach or what, what? whatever we call it now. But anyways, I promised him that I'd play a song from his band, so hope you're listening, Ren. Here are the red-headed bedwetters with baby carrots. Red-headed bedwetters with baby carrots. <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> That's awesome. That's what I I'm saying, Christina, dude. I agree. with her talent show judge face, was listening. Toot toot! We must oh. be getting close. There's no radio reception on the island. I'm glad I got to hear it before it went totally kaput. If we can't use it, why'd you bring it? Not just for the boat. This is so uh, eerie. No. Like, what's You'll up? See. If I were ever driving I around in a boat like much, this and there's all this fog, nah, I'd, I'd feel very uncomfortable. It. You'll see. Like, how aren't these two guys, like, flipping out? Because obviously I'm the female protagonist right now, and I'd, fl I'd flip my nuts. Oh, that's so cute. That's us. That's adorable. Oh, it's just a loading screen. I think I'm actually going to cut loading screens out. Smell that clean air, boys and girls. Boy and girl. This ain't city living. Yeah. Huh, uh, nice. Anybody need a smoke? I have a <laughs> full pack. Uh, oh, smoke. Uh, smoke no is thanks. bad, dude. I mean, I literally just said the clean air thing, so... Alex? You can bum one off me if you're empty. Uh, I forget if you're a fellow addict. Actually, oh, you know what? Oh. She doesn't smoke either, so... <laughs> oh, okay, thanks just for speaking for me, cuz. Alright, my other friend should be up and around the bed. Actually, that... I mean, I don't mean to be the guy to break us up already, but Ren, can you do me a favor? Can I have, like, two real quick minutes with Alex for a second? And uh, you can, you know, you can run up and meet your friends? Uh, really? Just... Jonas, come on. I vouched for you sight unseen, and you're already acting super weird. Yeah, And dude. I appreciate the voucher. I do, and I'm not trying to seem weird. I just want two minutes alone. That's it. All right, bud. <laughs> uh, look, I, I don't want to go up by myself. I mean, can't we just stick together? You're going to have all night to say, like, whatever. But since you want to meet up with your friends anyway... We're all going to meet up with them. I'll hear what you have to say, dude. It's fine, Ren. Go on up ahead, and we'll catch up with you. Um, okay. I guess. Huh. Though this is a really strange way to start off, splitting up. It'll be fast. Thanks, man. Oh, God. I'll just be up the hill in case... Sorry, bro. Whatever. Hey, what's so important? Ren seems nice. He's funny, you know? Reminds me of a guy I know back home. What the hell do you want to talk about, Yeah, dude? he's... <sighs> Look, just what did you want to talk to me about before I suspect something nefarious? No, it's nothing. It's not bad. Listen, I just wanted to grab you ahead of time and say you've been cool about everything and I guess it's just for me I, I, I've never moved anywhere and like getting a new family at the same time kind of feels like I'm skipping the training wheels and not that it's been bad or anything you and your mom have been great uh, we'll make do lemons lemonade however that goes an optimist oh Christ uh be proud of it bro <laughs> yeah I'm an optimist and proud of it Oh, and thanks for setting up the attic for me. It's cool how it's like a little bedroom. I was in the basement at my old house, so this... Yeah, no problem. Anytime. Don't be that bitch. I heard your mom's dead. <laughs> I heard about your mom. I'm sorry. Yeah, you know... What are you gonna do? You know, in all honesty, I don't we give two shits about you, bro. Back I don't give a fuck about your feelings. Take so long. Yeah. Bye. As if I paid any attention to you. I'm gonna go see that other guy. Are you my brother? Actually, I totally forgot. Ooh, what's this? Store. It's kind of kitschy. Right? It's kind of kitschy? Yeah, it's like a quiche. Oh, shit. Uh, if nobody lives here and the stores are all closed, whose car is this? Oh, Dog there's point. always that one lonely car in every parking lot. I actually probably stay with my. I think that was my brother over there. 
Just stay with him, because now I have no idea where I'm going. Statue. Ah, oh, I forgot this was even here. It's a monument to some submarine that was sunk off the coast. That's unfortunate. Oh, do the the um the radio guide thing they talked about on the boat, you know? Uh -huh. It's what, but one oh two point three. Yeah, maybe um, later, dude. I just want to get to the people. Maybe we can do the walking tour later, like after three beers. <laughs> okay, that's wow. true. The two we rebellious. will be here all night. No, I think I'll play my game as if I was a rebellious teenager, because you know my senior year, I'm straight edge, and you know I do nothing. Early. So I'll play I this no as if I was staying open if nobody's myself, here. So why not? Um, uh, that's true. Whatever. I don't know what you said. I was, wasn't paying attention to you at all. I, I don't I don't like this guy already. I don't know who you Hello, are. Kids. I think you're my no, brother, but I don't like you. Be up, so be quick now. Okay, speed read definition of Edwards Island. This is a tourist trap with shops and a beach. Nobody lives here except for some geriatric named Mrs. Adler. Move. But, as God is my witness, we'll never mention her or any other old person's name again. We are here to drink and be stupid. A tradition apparently started by bored recruits in the 1950s who would sneak dates over from the coastal towns. They literally called it trawling. Uh-huh. How'd they pull that Wait, out? how'd they pull that? Isn't, like... The beaten path officially ends here. The beach is past the fence. I think Jerry told me that there's a way that you used to get over there, but I'm blanking on Huh, maps. Cool. Oh, yeah, I forgot how to get there. On what it was. But it's not, I mean, it can't be too difficult. So, to summarize, we are not allowed here after dark. The town is shut down, and we, the Kamina High junior class, have come to commit improper acts. And the other thing is the weirdo cat. I think the dumpster will get us over if it'll budge. Well, let's try it. Yeah, help me. I think you're my brother, anyway, actually, my step brother, but you're annoying, man. Keep the whole slink over and camp thing alive and well. No, no, no. I, um, I, I got it. Improper acts? What does that even mean? Soaping windows? Yeah, I don't think that'll get us tossed in the stockade. No. But maybe the fact that I brought a whole crap ton of drugs will. Oh, uh, well, yeah, that'll do it then. Why? <laughs> Why? I don't want to babysit you when you go on a bad trip. You're not gonna have to babysit me. I've been looking forward to this for a really long time, and I'm not leaving the fun part of this to chance. That's all. And the other thing is the weirdo caves. Weirdo caves? Those I want to check out. Alex brought her radio is because when you go to the... It's like the front. The mouth? The mouth of this particular cave, you can sometimes pick up frequencies to stations that don't exist. You'll hear voices or just sounds. It's um, Shit's creepy. It's pretty creepy. At least I've heard. I did it once. It's amazing when it works. So back up a second. Who's Mrs. Adler? Her family, I think, like. Uh, I didn't want to skip on that, but I kind of didn't want to stay at that place for too long. We'll probably continue the conversation near the other end, anyways. Nine PM. Oh, uh, before we get there, I should I should probably mention that. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. Who's that? That's so. There's this girl, Nona. She's just this girl, and I'm totally into her, and I want her to be into me. So just you know, j just be cool, okay? No problem. No complaining doing? or anything. All right? Deal? Why wouldn't I? Don't be like just how you can be sometimes. Oh, and okay, Jonas. Now that we're dumpster buddies. Fuck. What was the thing that you said to Alex back there? Do you have one of those vestigial tails or something? Uh, it was nothing, really. Just leave it. Reginald, I hear you over there. Hey, guys. Wait, I was saying... I was about to tell a story. What was it? About Brad's car? Oh, well, that can wait. Hmm. Hey. We started a fire down the way, but Nona wanted to play beach nanny, so... Uh, yeah. Hi. Hi. And Jonas, that's... Who are you? Jonas. That's Jonas. He's Alex's new in town, fresh as the daisy stepbrother. Stepbrother. Okay, so he's really? my stepbrother. Yeah, I know. It's a yeah, nice guy. This is his first night here, so everybody be on your best behavior. Treat him as you would a scary dog. Palms out. <laughs> That's um I don't bite. It's fine. Wait, 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 wait. You're Jonas. Jonas the stepbrother. Yeah. Um what's your name again? Oh, that is Clarissa. How but are she's your stepbrother. Like, what does that even mean? Um, I'll give you three guesses. 
<laughs> Her mom's getting remarried, that's all. She's getting remarried to a guy, and that's the guy's son. So, domino effect? Yeah, well, I guess this is happening now. This is a thing that is happening, so... <sighs> Where's everyone else? Nicole had that tennis thing. Uh, who else was supposed to come? Anyone? Everyone? Clarissa, we... <laughs> we took the last ferry. I thought more would show up, but... <laughs> oh my god, it's just Alex and her new stepbrother? Huh, that's it. That's who you brought. That's the group. Clarissa, hey, what the hell do you mean? Don't be mean. This is supposed to be fun. <laughs> Who's that I'm not having any fun? I'm having fun. This is like friggin' Candyland right now. Wait, aren't you all, like, friends? I'm friends with Nona, and I'm downgrading Ren to, like, a creepy neighbor. And you, I just met. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. Sorry. Fuck you, I accept going. your apology. What, did I, what did I do? You see, Jonas, normally this is like a 20-deep rager, but Pat had a party last weekend, and... And a bunch of kids got caught TPing the school. But this is great, right? We're on Edwards Island. Forget those losers who couldn't handle the weekend, who didn't think we could make it, who lost my invitation, who had to go Faster. on there. We've been hearing about this for years, and now we're gonna do it. This is gonna be amazing, right? Right, guys? Yeah, yeah. the beach, island stuff. Yeah. <laughs> I feel so. We got so Clarissa. Clarissa, um, she seems like the kind of bitch that'd fight if I were a girl. I destroy her <laughs> right now. <laughs> Straight up, I'd be throwing, I'd be throwing down on this beach. She'd be done. Uh, Big Bro Jonas, he seems a little awkward. Actually, more like myself right now in reality. Um, then this other guy, Ren, he seems like a, seems really outgoing, like a party type dude. But it's whatever. I mean, he's probably gonna die first if something happens. He's gonna die first. I know he's gonna die first. He's totes gonna die fire. first. Man's great equalizer. Who the hell so made this fire? what's the, um, what's the, like, thing to do here? This fire just, like, Other than up, obviously go skinny rock. dipping and get murdered by Jason yeah, Kruger. Yeah, let's drink. Yeah, let's just get drunk. It's supposed to be a party, right? True. Hey, where does that old woman live? Throw rock. Oh, you mean Maggie Adler? Swear. Yeah. Nowhere. She's dead. What? what? Yep, killed over three days ago. That it was sucks. all over the news. Local news, anyway. Oldest living resident. Her family's been moving back and forth on the ferry, getting all of her crap. Oh, that's sort of a bummer. Yeah, well, we all gotta go sometime, in her case, later than sooner. And to answer your previous question, Jonas, this? the thing I'll, to do is lay anyways. on the beach Thank and drink till you can't remember where you are. And sometimes play truth or slap. Yeah, let's play that. We can inaugurate Jonas. Truth or slap? What's that? We used to call it hippo, until we got tired of people asking, why is it called hippo? Because you get to yell, you're a dirty hippo, before you slap someone. You get asked a question. Ooh, you have to looks. tell the truth, but if somebody can prove that you lied, the accuser gets to slap you. It's a good, uh, getting to know somebody game. Oh, Unless fun. you lie a lot. Yeah, fun. An excuse to hit run. Hey, I'm the truthiest truth, whoever All truthed, right, let's uh, just get on with it. Sure you are, bro. Okay, so, first, we're gonna- I'll start. Ren. Uh-huh. Come on, fess up. You wanna go out with Nona, right? Clarissa! Wait, wait, Clarissa, come on. come on. You're supposed to ask, like, have you ever stole something? Not super weirdo probing stuff. You ask probing stuff if you play the game right, Alex. Look, it's tough to gauge. Uh, something like... <laughs> Enough stalling. I know you want to sample the goods, now no. just say so. I mean, I, I, I like her as a friend, right? That's... I just Dude. like her as a friend. That's, that's all. She's cool. Oh, liar? Liar! Dude, what He's the fuck? Totally Dude, come on. Her. What? Alex, come on, what are you doing? <laughs> I knew it. You can practically smell it on him. <laughs> I'm gonna throw you on the bus you now. You told me you liked her. Why do you even try to cover... You knew I knew. I'm standing right here. Dude, I'm drunk because now. Because <laughs> I asked you to be cool about it, and now you're being like... Whatever the complete opposite of cool is. I was gonna be a dick, I'm drunk. <laughs> but in a bad way. All right, Alex, you get first blood. Slap him like he stole something. Oh, gee, I can't looks. believe this is happening. This really doesn't. <laughs> and it's not even my birthday. I don't like you anyways. Ow! <laughs> <laughs> I'm a savage. I think you had it in you. Yeah. She's full of surprises. But I am. Backstabbing surprises. What? Lying. So, Alex's turn? Oh, great. Here we go. Uh, What's your favorite stuffed animal? Calling you out, oh, bitch. Boy. Yes, Mum? This is pretty fun just watching, I'll admit. Well, hmm. wait. If someone were to ask you to describe me, what would you say? Calling wow. you out. Really swinging for the fences here. I'd tell them you were an average girl with common thoughts. Jeez, why don't you say what you really think? 
Okay. Actually, to be honest, you're wrong. I think you're wrong. So I haven't seen much evidence to the contrary. So okay, okay, okay. Beef girl. let's keep it moving. I'll slap you. Chris let let me slap now. her. Alex, you got a new brother. Pretty exciting. I'm sure Jonas is excited, or maybe excited isn't the right word. Maybe a little overwhelmed with just everything, you know? What are you talking Unsure. about, dude? It's a lot to take in and adjust to. That's your point. point, Clarissa. I'm just saying what Jonas is already thinking. That statistics show if you get divorced once, you're probably going to get divorced again. And the fact is, your mom divorced your dad. So let's put his mind at ease and hear why. I okay, just get to whatever point this is getting to. The point is, why'd your parents get a divorce? Just so Jonas can hear it from you. Clarissa, I don't really care why they got a divorce. Just that Alex's mom is happy now. You know why. Michael died, and it broke everything, and they couldn't handle it. The end. Well, now Bitch. you know, How you Jonas. Feel now? Don't die, and everything will be fine. Okay, Clarissa. Oh, foreshadowing. You know, guys, honestly, I think I'm pretty much ready to do anything else besides this game. Wait, let's... Let's not stop like this. We should... Let... Game's over, Ren. I won. And to celebrate, I'm gonna sit on the beach and drink, and maybe, if I'm feeling spicy, even take a nap. Maybe we could And get... that's exactly what Nona's gonna do, too. I hate oh this Oh my bitch. god, you are annoying. This isn't me being annoying. This is me being tired. There's a difference. Cheese! If you guys in your scavenger hunt or playing Ring Around the Rosie big. happen to find anything more interesting than a slowly dying starfish, you be sure to just let me know. Super... Whatever. <sighs> Whatever. Well, I want to inaugurate this bitch you. by checking out the caves. No, no, want to come? Sounds uh, cool. I mean, I would. I'm but... very clingy, Ren. <sighs> Fine. Jonas, you're a strapping young lad. Help boost me over the fence. The cave's just, uh, yonder. And I guess you expect me to just jump over after? Well, like I said, you're a strapping young lad. Okay, come on. Where are you from again? It's a small town near North Valley. Oh, yeah. Is it nice? If you like bars on the windows. Do I have to go with you guys? You know, I feel like I do want to go with you guys. Alex, cause... you want to check out the caves, or...? Huh? Yeah, yeah, let's do it. Why not? Boost me up? Yeah, come on. Live you two bitches. Hate that girl. Leave my over there. <laughs> I'll push you over. Oh, oh, I forgot. We Whenever never talked you're about ready. Dawn. Oh, what, their date? Yeah, he he is. Is. I get a crank in my back, which... <laughs> How do you even get Jenny out of the house? <laughs> I don't know. So, the cave. What's your bets? On a scale of 1 to 10, how weird's it gonna be? Hmm. Ah, super weird. It's Ren, so definitely 10. He gets excited easily, but he has the concentration of a goldfish. The fact that he keeps demanding we see it must mean something. <laughs> All right. Hey, Chris seems to be her normal annoying self. Sorry about that. Hate that bitch. Yeah, Ren, about Nona. Yeah, what the hell was up with you and the whole me liking her thing during the game? Dude, I was drunk. I mean, okay, <laughs> fine. Fun is fun. But I'm trying to get in with this girl, and it was as if you liked making me look like an idiot. It's a game called Truth or Slap, Ren. It's supposed to be a goof. I thought you'd laugh. Why would I laugh at that? Uh, it really sucked, actually. Sorry, dude. I'm sorry. I am. I I was just trying to have fun. Yeah, I, I didn't drunk. know you would take it so seriously. Well, I am. I mean, I do, but it's fine. I'll just have to work the old Ren charm even stronger now. Gross. Gross, come on. Now, who's ready to have their minds blown? If you don't mean that literally, I am... Me, me, me. Oh, wait. Actually, I almost forgot. Gonna take a little magic trip to Cupcake Town. Those oh look gosh. like brownies. Brownie time. Yeah. Oh, Give you're the only one? Gimme. <laughs> oh, no. These are just for me. I've been waiting a long time for this. Yeah, Poor. maybe it's best he's the test balloon for this anyway. Fair enough. Hmm. Delicious. Okay, so see these little piles of rocks? The kids before us always leave them here so you know where to try and tune in the signals. So you're going to want to stand basically right around here. And just tune the dial left or right until you start hearing some weirdness. Okay. How will we know when it's... Oh? Oh, that's 
really weird. But... Holy crap! What the hell? Wow, it's even cooler than I thought it would be. This is insane. What is it? What's doing it? Maybe the tuning's like unblocking a weather balloon or something? <laughs> uh... It doesn't make any sense. Maybe not. Well, it's just crazy, then, because I don't know. If you move around, it kind of changes, too, I think. Like, over at this pile. Here, come over here and try it. I think it's like 105, right? No? This is okay. so cool. I know! Clarissa and Nona should see this, right? No, I, mean, I know it's like weird no with you guys or whatever for Nona's some reason, cool. but She's quiet. They, I like her. they're fine where they are. Okay, just what is Clarissa's issue with you two? Who cares? It doesn't matter. Uh, it sounds so... It's cool. Yeah, it sounds... Uh... Scary. It's freaking me out a little. Yeah. Wait, what was that? Oh, it's coming back. There's like, this is gonna sound stupid, but there's like something in here. Famous last words. Famous. No, I see it too. I'm sure there is something in there, like a giant rabies-filled bat, or a maniac who wears mannequin wigs. Okay. Or Dude, that it kind of looks like man. a pool or something, like a freshwater one maybe. Let's check it out. It's not that far in. <laughs> if it's Go. a pool, that'd be cool. I um didn't mean that to rhyme. <laughs> cool pool. Fortune favors the bold. <laughs> Bye. That was an odd. Wait a minute, Jonas. Well, I am going to just rest against here because I think, shh, I think I mismeasured the magic. Oh, freaking idiot. Yeah, you do that. Do what? Ah. <sighs> Well, yeah, I'm gonna end it off right here, and I'll see you in the next one when we uh, go enter the cave. Hmm. Shut up. Forget it.